showing you a different type of video. This time, today, I'm going to be showing you how to do motion tracking, like tracking a fingerboard while doing a fingerboard trick on Final Cut Pro. It's really similar to do on iMovie. So, this is how you do it in Final Cut Pro. You want to hit this right here at the top, that button to import the video that you want. Mine is this one. It's a kickflip to 50-50. There. I did that while camping, so you want to import that. Once you've imported that, that's the wrong clip. My bad. Right here, this one, you want to import it. And then choose the basically the how much resolution you want this is how much i want basically so you hit okay then you want to i should have done this early 50 percent yeah this works okay let me just turn this off okay so you want to start when you when you like want to start to track it you want to trim it so mine is right here you want to hit command b command b trims the clip and then you also want to trim it at the end when you want to stop tracking it so now when you have this big clip right here you want to command c copy it and paste it again then you paste this clip wait a second okay sorry about that one boys <laughs> then go to the end paste it this okay now i got it boom you just want to set this right on top of the other so you basically want to once you're aligned you want to take the top clip and then hit this button right here this one the transform or you hit the arrow down and hit transform either way works then you want to zoom in as much as you want to make sure to zoom in enough like this should be fine Okay, and once you've done that, you want to hit this button right here. Uh, no, wait, this button right here, the middle. Boom. And then just hit the arrows you have on the sides for it to go to the next frame. And then just slide it up so it's always in the center. And you don't have to do anything else. Just like this. This might take some time. But it's worth it. Boom. That was not a good landing. Don't even write in the comments. I know it wasn't good. And boom, you are done. So now, when you watch the whole clip, it looks somewhat like this. Voila. This is really simple. It takes you maybe five minutes. It took me probably less than five minutes because I do this a lot. So. Thanks for watching. If you want me to do more of these tutorials on how I re edit and record my videos, leave a comment below. That's it for today's video. Bye.